Hey guys, welcome back. And this episode is pretty much carrying on from the last episode. Um, I'm still farming herbs at the minute, but I did manage to get it just a second ago. I got an unholy symbol mold um, as a drop. And what that means is now is I don't have to mess around trying to get a Zamorak road bottom or top for my uh, Zami item. I can simply make the unholy mold, unholy mold um, into an amulet. All I need to do with that is just some silver ore and a ball of wool. And then from there I've got my Zamorak item ready. So that's very good. Um, I think that makes my last trip. Uh, I've got quite I've got another unholy mold there, look. So now I've got two. I'll take it. No, I wouldn't take it. But yeah. Just so you know, I haven't cheated and bought one. I actually did get it. <laughs> I was leaving them. Like, I wasn't bothered picking them up. And I suddenly thought, actually, I, I could use that. So you know, I did pick it up. And so yeah, I've also just started taking some Mythal bolts as well. I haven't got many. Um, but you know, I decided, you know, I never know. I might get someone and think, God, I wish I could just fucking, you know, pop them off with a range or something. I don't know. So I decided that, you know, maybe it is worth just taking them. Um, I'm surprised actually, the rarest herb that I seem to find, believe it or not, is gone. Like, unless you're getting none. Uh, once so, alright, uh, guys, just mum shouting me down for dinner. Uh, just got a double round our job just then, just before I paused it. Um, so, yeah, I guess I'll go get some dinner now and then come back up and finish this off. <laughs> okay, guys, well, I just realised once again that I'm a fucking idiot. I do not need gorms, it's super attacks into extremes. Honestly god, my head's just not with it today. I was thinking like, yeah yeah, I've got to make normal potions into super potions into extremes. But I just thought, no that's not right. I've just got to make super potions into extremes. So basically I've got a load of herbs now that I do not need. <laughs> um, but you know, whatever. It, it, it don't take long anyway. But um, I'm just going to fill up this invent and then I'm going to go bank. But I'm going to try and fill it with herbs that I do need. Um, and obviously the spawns are a great place, you know, I mean, there's loads of irrits over here. And obviously there's the, um, ran out over the other side. Uh, if it's there, yeah, it is there, look. I mean, so the spawns are great, you know, you can save a lot of time just grabbing the ran out and irrits. So I should have loads of super, um, what? Oh, I just missed that pile of water, that's a shame. Well, one more and then I'm done, and this is it then. So I managed to get myself 16 lore runes altogether, and 58 earths. Um, which isn't bad. Uh, I don't get many natures per trip, but you know, it doesn't matter anyway because they just all go into the bank. And they stack. So, 23 mythal bolts. I wish I collected them from the start, to be honest. Uh, we'll probably add a couple more. We've got a spec. Yeah, spec a couple out. See if we can get lucky. Double round our drop, please. Coins and. nothing. Nice. Come on, I need, I need one more. Just literally, just one more. Just give me one more. There you go, you're dead. Give it to me. God damn it. You're dead. Oh my god, this is terrible. On the right side, guys, if I ever need to, I can make normal attack potions now. Seriously, what are the chances of me not getting a herb at all in all these kills? Well, I've got herb, but it's like a gorm and stuff. A herb that I need. There we go, that'll do. And previous destination. Okay, guys, I'm back, and here we go. Let's put a bank in again because obviously I got logged out uh, while I was waiting. So I'm just gonna pause the video once again. Okay then. So these are the herbs that I managed to collect. And see, I did quite a few trips. And um, quite a few herbs. So. I don't really know where to start. I need some more of ours water. So I guess we'll start there and then we'll start on secondaries instantly. Um, so secondaries, what do I need? Let's think. I need I have newts, I need limpwet roots, I need snake grass, I need the white berries I think. Which white berries they were pain in the ass. I might leave defense potions for now and do that later, but I definitely need some limps, I have newts, snake grass. Um, so, yeah, I guess the best place to start would be Port Serene. Yeah, I'll buy some I have newts down there. And, oh, in fact, I could have gone to Tavoli, but I think the guy in Tavoli sells vials as well, I'm not sure. But if not, I know for a fact I can definitely buy some vials from Ardy. 
Or Dune, as it's, as it's called. Or Dune, I don't know. Hardy. So, we're up here and it's Betty, I think. I think it's, is it Betty the Wizard? Oh, could buy a ring. I don't need a ring. I think I'm going to 16k anyway. But it's like 50k for a ring. Come on then, Betty, what you got for me? I'm sure she sells like boxes of Hive Newts, which is great because it means like I can just buy them in, in bulk in one go. Uh, no, she doesn't, she sells single ones. Fuck. Well, that's just brilliant, isn't it? And she I need some cosmics, she shouldn't even sell cosmics. How gay is that? She does sell wizard hats though, so I will buy a wizard hat. Give me some nice mage bonus when I'm doing my slayer darting. I don't have a helm yet, so that's that. Right then. It looks like being Tavali. I'm sure the guy I'm sure the guy in Tavali definitely, maybe not, might do, possibly not, sells them. Um I've been wrong quite a few times today. What it is guys, I was up to like 5 a.m. and then I took my sister to work at like 9 a.m. So I literally now got less than four hours sleep. Um I just don't know what I'm doing. I, my, my head's just it's just a shed. Um, actually, I actually don't even know where the old thing is. Where, where's the herb floor place now? Oh god. World map. Let's go. I'm looking for that guy. What's he called? Zaf. Zaf. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to try and remember his name. But um, it's from the quest. When you get when you do the herb thing, you go upstairs. We used to go upstairs. Before they changed everything and made it all shit. Down. See, everything's just like everything's gone. Like, everything that used to be where it should be is all just gone. Oh god! I've got no idea what where it is. But let's just find the herb icon and we'll go from there. So herb icon's here. Druid circles there. And there's not a building around there at all. Brilliant. Just fucking brilliant. Oh god. We'll try one of these places with the circles, it might even be one of them. It's so annoying how I don't know why they had to change everything like we did, you know what I mean like oh yeah. What the fuck? I didn't I didn't even set a marker, I swear to god I did not set a marker. And then we're like, oh yeah, it, it's like a start place for members. But it's like well they start off, you know, in London like everybody else, like we all did. We don't need a start place for members. You learn it as you go, that's you know, part of the fun of it. Um, it's just, yeah, this is the anime, Sam Fu. So it should be upstairs in this place. Um, should be a guy to trade. No, see, they fucking changed it. Useless bastards. Who's that over there? Is that him? Why can't I click him through the big wall now? So yeah, he's having an option either to trade. I guess just talk to this guy, maybe it's just a talk one now. No, they read what it says, spam through it, so I don't know if it's told me where to go or anything. That's such fucking bullshit. Who's downstairs? Anyone useful? Who's that? Ivy, someone over, blood, blood, no offense. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Right, I'm gonna pause it till I find out where I need to be, guys. Okay, so they have changed it. You, you, you now trade a guy called Poltax, which just doesn't make sense to me. He gives you free stuff anyway. So I'll take the free vial of water, I'll take the free eye of new, and then uh, vial of water packs. How much of these? You get 50 for 500. It's only 1 GP each. So. 50 be enough? I'll, I'll get two packs of them. How many do you get in a pack of this? In the eye of newts, you get. Yeah, how many is in it? Oh, pack of 50 again. Okay, so 50 will be plenty of 150 coins. That's fine then. Um, best one, that's all I'm going to talk about anyway. So that should be that then. So I can open them. And open them. Okay, and then now I need, I know, I want some snake grass, don't I? So to get snake grass, we'll go to Lunar Isle and work our way backwards. I think it's faster than doing it the other way around. Um, I think one event of Snake West should do it, and then I can head back to Edgeville and uh, start collecting up 
Um, little wet boots from the hill giants there. That's where I'm going to go for the, the things. So I've got to take the boat across and then go to Waterbirth Island. Um, what's next? I think so. That'll be attack potions. I'm now getting some prayer potions, and I'll just jump for that. Will be it, won't it? I'm almost ready, guys. I'm almost ready. Um, oh, I also did get, grab myself a set of druid robes because I can pray then um, if I need to. I don't know if I'm going to use it or not. I'm still not sure what the best thing to do will be. Um, you know, I mean, it's been a long time since I did anything, so I'm still not sure whether I'd be better off praying or just tanking it in room. I mean, I haven't done barriers in room since, or well, anything relevant in room to be honest. I don't know if at some point I would have done, but not that I can really remember. Um, so I don't know if I can tank it in room or not. But you know, all I'll do is I'll just do a few trips, um, see how it goes. I mean, if I don't need to pray, then I can just throw Jewish shit away. That rhymes, that's quite cool. Oh no, I've gone down the wrong fucking way again. Um, yeah, so I mean, if I, if I don't need the prayer bonus, then I can just I can just dump the druid stuff. Obviously, if I'm getting wrecked in the uh, in the room, then I might be tempted just to uh, you know keep it and just pretty much farm quite a lot more ranors and do it that way. So I'm just constantly praying. The only problem with that is I'll get less runs per trip if I need to pray. Um, oops, what am I doing? So yeah, anyway, I'm going to go to Waterbirth and fill up my event and then home port back to Edgeville. Okay guys, so I've got a full event. Uh, just got to go back to Edgeville now. Bank all this stuff. Um, and then head down to the hill giant place. So, it's coming on nicely. Make some good progress. Okay guys, we'll have geared up. We're looking pretty pro right now with all my cool stuffs. I've got myself two tuna. Just in case, and I want to make a long trek down to the Hill Giants. Um, what I will do is probably grab myself, is it a brass key? I think it's a brass key. That way then I can access it from the Valak side, which is much, much faster. Um, I'm also I'm trying to think of ways um, that you know, I, could, I could get my hands on a Dragonstone. Um, I'm not sure if I can do Puro Puro. I'm not sure how I go about getting the Impling Jars. Um, but I mean that might be an idea if I can catch a dragon implant and get a, a dragon stone from it. Although I know how weird dragon implants are anyway, so that might not work out too great. Um, failing that, it's going to be like I don't really know. I might have to find a monster to camp. And hope that I get lucky and, and what get a two half shot or something. I mean that's guaranteed dragon stone. Not sure. I don't know if there's any. Imps that will give you a, you know, a two path or even a full crystal key. Um, so yeah, I've still got quite a lot of looking into things, a lot of research to do still. For now I just grab myself a dusty key, a brass key, just to keep for blue dragons, isn't it? Do it. Boom. Brass key. And is he a resource dungeon? I think there's one down here in the resource dungeon for the hill giants. What? Uh, I don't know where. There we go. Yeah, baby. Vroom. Never been here either. <laughs> so I don't use any any of these things. Let's go. Sit down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Take the coins. There's some limbs. What are the limbs on the floor? Iron arrows, potato seeds, coins. I mean, it's like random spawns. Like, do you know what I mean? Limp work spawns. Yes, limp spawn. Oh, how many of those is there around the cave? I wonder. Oh, there's loads. There's loads of them. Oh, that's wicked. That'll do. They will kill me because just run around picking up the limp works, can't it? Get in. Run off. Stolen. Yeah guys, there's no rules against looting by the way, just, you know, it's not like people actually dropping me stuff. Um, that would be too far, I think, if people actually purposely gave me stuff, but just looting drops and that. It's probably one of the ways I'm going to make some money, to be honest. Um, you know, I might even go looting in a worldie. 
try and grab myself a pair of room boots or dragon boots or something. Um, it might be faster than, than camping, but I don't know. Well, let's do it, you know, one episode just out of the way. Um, have they respawned yet? They haven't, they? Oh, I think it, there we go. Oh, wow. So, yeah, these respawn this year as a man, so I can just remind the circles collecting these up. Um, so, I guess that's what I'm going to do then. Okay, then, guys, so I've uh, got for the moment, I'm going like a headless chicken. Um, I'm going to deposit all my little roots now. And that's where my man are. And deposit all the rest of that crap that I've got on me. And now I guess I can make some potions. So I'll start off with with the Ranars. Where have we gone? Nothing for that as well. Right. Now I'm a bit confused right now. As to what stage I'm at. In fact, I should probably do something with Granite Exchange. Um, to make it easy for me to keep track of things then, like just to count them into fours. <coughs> um, fast enough to do it myself. So yeah, I'll do that, I went to the GE, uh, make up potions, to count on potions, and then next time you'll see what I what I had. Um, obviously this might take a while, so I'm going to do it off vid. So, I'll see you for the next episode soon.